Reddit Ads Tutorial. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can use Reddit Ads. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. Now I'm over here on their main website, Reddit Ads. Now if you want to come over here, all you got to do is just simply search for Reddit Ads. These two links will pop up. You can click either one of them and it'll take you over to Reddit Ads. If you click the first one, then just simply it's going to take you over here. Then you just simply click on Advertise on Reddit. Then it's going to take you over to reddit ads as well or you can go with the second link it it all depends on you either way you're going to be coming over here now let's get started so over here it's pretty simple you just have to enter in the company name or company username to appear on ads password company name business email first name last name business phone number business website industry country and then just simply sign up right so we're signing up over here on reddit ads so after that you just you'll be good to go so i'm gonna go ahead and fill out this form and i'll catch you guys in a second all right so over here we have created a campaign as you can see over here now all that's left for you to do is so over here as you can see once we have signed up this is how it looks like and over here on the left side we have some details but we'll get into that later first things first we need to create a new campaign we have to enter in the campaign name its objective and funding instruments right so let's go ahead and do that over here so the name of this could be anything you want it's just a name that would you would you know organize it with so we'll just say and then objective of it is to get as many uh you know traffic to our website so we'll go ahead and do that and for this we need to set up reddit pixels so you must set up reddit pixels to matter your performance and optimize delivery so we'll go ahead and do that so install on a website manual place the reddit pixel code on your website or set up with google tag or send a developer it all depends on you we can go ahead and do this with this uh you know install on your website so all we have to do is just go ahead and do that so like the parameters yeah that looks good we'll click on next now this is the code and this is your advertising id so over here we have to copy the pixel code we'll copy that Number two, paste the code in your website. All right. So this will be an example. The code inside the head and head tags of your head ads landing page and each page where you want to add, you know, the conversion. So this is like, you know, the example. And then we need to put the pixel code within the head and the head with the backslash. And then we are good to go. So let's go ahead and do that so over here i'm on wix this is the website that i have so let's go ahead and take a look at our website right so this is it so we need to edit that so we'll just go ahead and click on edit this site it's gonna take a little bit second to load up the editor then we are good to go all right so as you can see over here this is how it looks like so what we're gonna do is we're gonna click on add over here and then over here we're gonna have a bunch of different options what we need to do is we need to come over here onto embedded code and over here we will see we have marketing tools we have development tools and animations and all of that okay so over here what we're going to do is we're going to go into the marketing tools and over here we can see we have custom codes google analytics google tag manager and all of that what we'll do is since they said to add the google tag manager we're going to do that but we also have to connect our google analytics with it as well so what we're going to do is we're just simply going to go with a custom code all right so we're going to add that over here going to click on it it's going to open up this pop-up where we have to do the setting so over here as you can see we have twitter google analytics we have t ads this is for the twitter ads right so we're going to go ahead and do another add a custom code we're going to paste the snippet over here there we go so what is this it's a custom code all right from bed add body start body end we're going to do that and we're going to do it on every page each new page as well so on each page it's going to load on each new page on the body so we're going to apply that and we are good to go so as you can see we have the custom code over here now we are good to go then we can go ahead and go move on so next as you can see we already done that next we need to add a credit card or stuff like that but pretty much that's it then we just simply click on continue then we're going to come over here onto the ad grouping where we actually you know go ahead and start editing the ad you know adding the ad settings so over here as you can see right now it's max and narrow over here on the right side estimated recommended range is over here one dollar 
So what we need to do is we need to narrow it as possible. We don't want to go ahead and go to the max. We want to narrow it as small as possible. We want to target a specific group. And also, if you're going to target a specific group, it's going to cost you more than, you know, the more people. So keep that in mind. So over here, again, we're going to call it, we're going to name it recruitment. And then over here, audience type, it can be anything. And we, if you already have a saved audience, you can go with that one. But if not, you can go ahead and create a new one. So over here, you can choose whichever one you want, depending upon your need. So we'll just say entertainment. And in entertainment, we have all these different things. And we also could use some other ones such as technology and computing and automotives. No, we don't need automotives. We'll go with gaming. Yeah. And then over here in communities, you can add different communities. We can add over here on, you know, Ask Reddit. It's one of the biggest communities out there. We don't want announcement because that's for the announcements. Um, we can also go with, um, you know, YouTubers or YouTubes or stuff like that. You know, as you can see over here, our bar is moving down. We're getting more narrower and narrower. So we need to actually go ahead and do this as well. So we'll go with, you know, um, videos and we'll add some more like that and like the you know groups that are related to our business or stuff like that so keep that in mind we'll go with technology and we'll also go with you know softwares as well i believe here we go yeah and then we need to add in location so as i said before if you target a specific location within a city like say you know you want your ads to be running in new york especially in new york and nowhere else then you're gonna have to pay a little bit more so depending upon where you add your look you know your ad so let's just say new york and as you can see over here it's gonna go down even more you know even narrower and as you can see it's going narrow and our price is going up so that's pretty amazing keep that in mind so now what we're gonna do is all right so as you can see then we can add like you know specific android devices or ios devices or desktop it all depends on you where you want to you know target your ads so let's go with you know ios or desktop right let's go with android and desktop we'll get rid of ios and see how it is so as you can see price went up it went more narrow now because we're now actually going more specific and then we can even go with you know a carrier to make it even more specific but we don't want that we don't care about what carriers they use now over here this is the placement of the ads where you want this ad to be shown either in you know as a feed or converse or in conversations i'll choose feeds because that's where usually it is and then we have the delivery all right so over here we have the budget the daily budget and the bid so what we want to do is over here when people generally tend to make new ads they tend to overexpend they tend to overspend their budget so we don't want that we want to keep our budget limited we want to keep it as small as possible and then you know if you feel like you know it's improving or you're getting something then you can go with a bigger budget and then if you feel like you're not getting that much of an improvement then you can lower it down and you know find your own sweet spot you know going keeping your prices up and down so so for the daily budget instead of fifty dollars we'll just go with let's say maybe 10 and over here for the bid it's gonna be you know as you can see over here the recommended range is 2.83 so it's still a little bit too much but we'll go with two dollars instead of three we'll go with two dollars per click and then run continuously starting today or set up a campaign start and end date it depends on you and over here you'll spend up to twelve dollars per day on this campaign so keep that in mind so what that will mean is that if it's a month you know then so that would mean that you would be spending at least three hundred and sixty dollars per month so keep that in mind uh, which is pretty decent it's not over expensive but yeah that's the amount you're going to be spending if you run it continuously or you can set up a campaign start and end date you know run it for a month and see what you get but uh it all depends on you then just simply click on next and then over here is basically where you start to create your ad so over here you enter in the ad name that's going to be appearing on the ad then you can add promotion types or create a new post over here and then you can add other trackers as well so we're going to have so we're going to say join now 
join now and start making a difference or something like that and then we'll just simply click over here on a new post and then over here we'll just drag and drop the video or carousel or image or whatever and then over here if you want you can even add like a destination url you know if you already have this video uploaded and then down below we will have a call to action we have sign up or contact us form or whatever so we can go with an apply now and over here this is how it's going to be and over here you can add your own uh, url and of course you're going to have to upload a small video you know write a compelling headline over here so we'll just go ahead and upload an image and yeah we'll upload that and yeah and then we can over here add our destination url you know your ad redirected over here so basically over here you uh, have to upload over here you have to upload the link to your website or the page where you want people to sign up with so I'll just simply paste it over here let me just get rid of that https there we go yeah i think that looks good and then you are good to go then just simply click on submit all right we have to add like a headline as well so let me just copy that you can add your own headline but you know it all depends on you and then down below you have your link then down below we can go with contact us or apply now there we go we don't want comments or if you want comments it all depends on you we'll go with that and then over here we'll just say what are you waiting for and then we'll just simply click on submit and we should be good to go there we go as you can see this is how it's gonna look like and then you just add your trackers then good to go then you just simply review your ad see if everything looks good everything looks working according to you all of your data and all of your needs and then just simply publish that ad and you are going to go so that's it that is it for this video that's how you use reddit ads and that's how you use to create an ad and post it on reddit so having said that thank you guys for watching if you have any questions let me know in the comment sections down below and i'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible so having said that i'll catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye